stumbling block in my life. Them no wants to strive. One day at a time, to give more blessing. Even in abundance, sorry, ain't got nothing. Still a call for me king. It's more blessing. Give thanks to life, loot and fair present the mindset. Blessed love, manners and respect. Do give thanks and praise for life. This is the Mindset Program. I just am your host. And I'm here with a great honor to be here with the Honorable Muta Baruka. Yeah, man, give thanks, man. Rastafari. Yes, I give thanks. First and foremost, I want to congratulate you on your lifetime. Oh, achievement. Yeah, yeah, I repent. Yes. But we don't get it yet. We don't get it yet. No, the 24th. The mindset, top provoking. You know. I'm your host, I'm ever I just start. I was there with our brand new mindset series live on the YouTube. Subscribe, I just start mindset channel. YouTube, bless the love. Blessed love, pleasant good afternoon, good evening, warm welcome. This is the mindset program. I just time your host and it's a great honor to have the item here on board. I want to greet the item in the divine name of his imperial majesty, Emperor Il Selassie I the first, Empress Menin the first, Holy Manuel I, Selassie I Ja, Rastafari. Warm welcome, great to have the item here. Zain, Honorable I just star. And um, what we're looking at today. And before we even get into what we're looking at today, I want to um, large up the sponsor of the program, which is Black Star International Media over there in Houston, Texas. Also, Yard Slang Closing Zin. Check them out all online and um, you know support what is going on. So, um, what we're looking at today is the system breed black drug dealers black drug dealers in england what is is it that creating quote-unquote criminals in the black community that is what we're looking at today what is creating young black drug dealers and why ethnic minority group are you know sentenced at a more are more likely to be sentenced immediately than their white counterparts so that is what we're looking at today and um we are gonna start off by playing a recording a recording that was um it's a excerpt from um the bbc zine on a on a on a, on a criminal case zine of um, some black um drug dealers here in the uk so um that's how we're gonna start off um right now scene so yeah here is um the recording Next tonight, the Nottingham drug dealers who were caught after flaunting their wealth by filming music videos in the Caribbean. They were arrested after a string of shootings in the city two years ago. The singer, Akeem Chan, has been described by the police as extremely dangerous. He's one of six men found guilty of serious firearms offences. They'll be sentenced in October. Our social affairs correspondent, Jeremy Ball, reports. A luxury yacht in an expensive resort in Mexico, Akin Chan used the name Brutes to rap about a violent lifestyle. This isn't just a music video, it's drug dealers taunting their rivals. Chan bragged about selling heroin, crack and cannabis. He texted hundreds of customers across Nottingham and Mansfield, promising unbeatable deals. But this was how they protected their turf. Shots fired at a house here on Hazel Hill Crescent, one of four tit-for-tat shootings in Nottingham in a single month. Kim Chan was very dangerous. These were reckless. One of the shootings on Brindley Road, uh, Akeem Chan was 
waiting for his uh, victim and as his victim drove past he stepped out and fired bullets at the car one of which actually hit the driver in the neck uh, at the time children were playing on the street in the vicinity and we're just really thankful that nobody was killed as a consequence of that and here on Melbourne Roads, this shotgun pellet was fired through a window and found embedded in a wall. That was Aking Chan's home. But his plans for revenge were all recorded by the police because they planted a surveillance bug inside his car. That's when armed police were sent in. This phone footage was filmed by a man they arrested. Chan posted it online. This was from one of the stash house locations. Where this is what officers recovered drugs and cash, and four loaded semi-automatic pistols, lethal weapons ready to use at a flat where Chan filmed a music video. The videos have been really useful because it's been able to show us the amount of money that they were making from their enterprise, being able to travel to the Caribbean and shoot music videos, making gun signs, counting large amounts of cash, and that was featured very heavily as part of the evidence in the case. These were individuals that weren't earning any legitimate income, and yet they seemed more than happy to show the world that they were living beyond their means. Hakim Chan and his friends wanted to show they were living the dream. Now they're facing the consequences, a reality of long prison sentences. Jeremy Ball. Yeah. So, um, as the island can, um, hear this up i don't know exactly when um that that incident or you know everything t- took place see but um that is going to be the basis of our reasoning today and um the whole thing of you know the system breed black drug dealers and black drug dealers in england what is that that create these quote-unquote criminals in the black community zin so the first thing what we have to really look upon is from the basic when you check the schooling and the social system zin is unfair towards black and minority seen and that is a reality when when you check how you know the household of black of black and minority when you check those household seen you you can see um the unfairness you can definitely see the unfairness that there's a disparity within the whole system of how um, black and minority people are being dealt with here in the UK. See? Now, I'm on, I am try to um, make an excuse for wrongdoings, but we have to look on the root cause. See? We have to look on the root cause of what has um, caused this, caused um the youths them to to be in this um situation zin coming out of slavery no one want to um you know risk them freedom zin because you know black people african people is not stupid zin coming out of slavery people that are here um in the west who went through that no one want to risk their freedom. You understand? So we have to check what what really caused this thing. Zin, the suppression is still there, having a subtle impact on African people in the West. Zin, the 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 the, 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 the suppression it is there. You understand? And because it is there and it an impact, Zin, the oppressive system, Zin, the oppressive system attack the family structure, Zin, from the very get-go, from the very get-go it attack 
the African family structure, in the family financing structure, our financial structure is being suffocated and snuffed out. Zin, that is the first thing. That is the first thing that you know needs to looked at and needs to address because if the financial structure within the black and minority home is not addressed then what what is going to happen because as i said no one want to be in poverty Zin, and no one is not stupid and want to risk their freedom seen nobody no want that so when you check most black family zin most black family is forced into poverty zin and the reality is nobody as me said no want to be in poverty that is that is the reality you know no one want to be in poverty see no one no want to be in a poverty my people right and if you have your financial structure as a family, if it's not up to par, then more likely it's like the system will push you in a direction where you, you, you don't want to go into that direction. But it's pushing you gradually. Zin, because it, 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 it makes things so difficult. Zin, that enough youths they're gonna look and probably the easier option and not only youths people probably going to look on the easier option zim and some of the time the easier options are not the best of 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 options because they come with life-threatening situation and you know threat of freedom and you know some of them at times see so England we have to check this in you know, a England with you know, and England was Britannia before it becomes Great Britain. Zin Britannia was a poor was a poor place and because no one wanted to live in poverty, England went into the slave trade. Not the drugs trade, Zin, but human trafficking. England, Britannia, and that is how England became, or Britannia become Great Britain today. Zin, that we have to check, we have to check that, you know, because England never want to be destitute and they never want to be poor and poverty stricken. Zin, them wanted to be what they are today. So, because no one no one hungry, what them do? Them go into slaving, slave trading. See? And who they were slaving and trading? It was Africans. The same descendants, the same people, the same youths them that is being locked up today. The same youths them that is... Um, in street gangs the same um slave with them with them transport is the same there are there are the descendants and they are the same people today the same youths is them same one today that has been transported is them you see in 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 involving these things because we are the descendants of what happened or our people who came through the transatlantic slave trade. That is the reality. See? So a lot of African youths from in the school, they are being marginalized. See? And at a disadvantage. The most black youths that is set successful today, they will tell us, yo, enough of the teacher them. 
Enough of the teacher them discourage them. So them couldn't become what them desire, what them did see them want to become. Enough teacher in you know, the school system, them, them discourage them and yet enough youths. As I said, enough of the successful youths them. Zin, them tell you that. Them tell us that the teacher discourage them. Teacher tell them so them couldn't become anything. And with that being said to a young African youth that whose drama from slavery, trauma from slavery haven't been dealt with. Now, what, what are you doing to his um, self-esteem? You know, what are you doing to his confidence? Telling him that he cannot become this or he cannot become that. Enough you no bind to it. Enough you them run from it and them because of that them get caught up into some things that them no want to get caught up into. See? And then enough you end up enough you end up a jail. See? Enough you end up a jail because them get caught into criminal activities because these things becomes criminal activities. See? Now, I'm going to read an article from um, the Independence. Right? Black Black and ethnic minority offenders convicted of supplying drugs are about one and a half times more likely to be immediately jailed than their white counterparts research has found. Analysis commissioned by the Sentencing Council has resulted in changes to the guideline given to judges and magistrates which aim to combat ethnic, ethnic disparity. See? Wow, where is that article? <laughs> okay. So where's the where's the rest of the article? Alright, um let me read it from a phone. Rest of the article. Um, be with me, my people. See, I have to read it from my phone. So, analysis commissioned by the sentencing council has resulted in change. Changes to the guidelines given to judge and magistrate which aim to combat ethnic disparity. It found that different sentencing outcomes were observed for different races even when the offense and other factors were the same. For Asian offenders and those in other ethnic groups, the odds of receiving an immediate custodian sentence for three drug supply offense were 1.5 times the size of the odds for white offenders said a report published January 2021. The odds of black offenders receiving immediate custodian sentence were 1.4 times the size the ads for a white offender. As a part of a wider package of new guidelines for drug offenses, the Sentencing Council said it has taken measures to address the gap, in, including drawing judges and magistrate attendance, attention to evidence of sentencing dis disparity in specific offenses. It has also introduced a passage saying that 
the demonstration of remorse which can be used to mitigate someone's sentence should not depend on someone's demeanor in the court. The equal charity which campaign for racial equality in criminal justice system had told the sentencing council that appearance of remorse was subject and that young black man involved in gang street culture are taught that public display of emotion show weakness making it difficult to display it in a legal setting. The council is committed to investigating apparent disparity in sentencing outcome. Further, a spokesman for the sentencing council said, as a part of this work, the council has conveyed an internal working group to consider what further step might be taken in this era and is in the process of commissioning a review of how its guidelines operate to help identifying any areas for further works. Shade cause the head of policy at Equal welcomed the change, but said there was a long way to go to reduce racial disparity across crimi the criminal justice system. Added, we would welcome further research by the Sentencing Council and other criminal justice department to understand whether other offenses also pose the same risk for blacks, Asian and minority ethnic groups, and Muslims. The Prison Reform Trust said the guidelines were unlikely to be enough on their own and that discrimination um, persists that persecution through to prison and resettlement. Mark the group end of policy added unless attention is given across the criminal justice system to address the disparity people from black asian and minority ethnic group will continue to experience worse outcome than their white counterparts release which conduct research and campaign and juggler said drug offenses were a huge driver for racial disparity in the criminal justice system. Real reform will not be achieved without an up overhaul of our drug law and a move towards decriminalization and regulation of drug the drug market. Zin said executive director Naya Eastwood. Racial disparity ex exists from drugs stop and search to, to arrest decision to, per to prosecute and sentencing. Yet across the world, we are seeing reform from recognizing that tinkering with the system is not enough. Rather, we must end the criminali criminalization of people who use drugs and support people currently involved in illicit market to transition to licit alternative. The revised sentencing guidelines aim to reflect a change in nature in the nature of offending and rise and the rise to psychoactive um, sub substances formerly known as legal eye. Changes include a rise in exploitation of vulnerable people as a part of county lines, dealing, dealing models, an increase in drug purity and new drug in the market. The new guidelines introduce um, aggravated factor 
that could increase sentence for offenders who use the home of a vulnerable person exploiting children or run county lines to send drugs from urban centers to small towns and rural areas. Judge Rebecca Kane, a member of the Sentencing Council, said drug dealing is a serious crime and the effect cut across all groups of people from um, addicts who live can, lives can be destroyed to their family and community to people forced to take part in the trade either through um, creation, co coercion are threats, some of whom are young and vulnerable people. These new sentencing guidelines provide a clear sen um, sentencing framework for the court. They cover all the main offenses and provide an approach to sentencing offending involving any type of drug. They will ensure that victim witness and the public will have clear information on how drug offenses are sentenced. The council has also taken this opportunity to include measures to address disparity that exists in the sentence outcome of drug offenders associated with the ethnicity. This is an important era of work for the council and we continue to explore whether any further changes could be beneficial to the guideline to help address any disparity in sentencing outcome. The court minister, Chris Phillips, said the guideline would ensure that the sentencing reflect a uh, severity, severity of crimes linked to drugs production and distribution, he added. The government is also investing um, $148 million to cut drug-related crime, dismantling gangs, while funding more tre treatment programs to stop the cycle of um, reoffending. And um, that article is from uh, the Independent. Zin? No. What is um what is important um to take from that you know is um when you talk about um small when you talk about small and rural and rural areas zin is um those are predominantly white people zin who live in those type of areas you know rural small towns you know what i mean are predominantly predominantly all right that that is a fact so white people is buying and using the drug so right away this so you know see white people have created a market for drug dealing right this so you know see based on based on what that article was saying there because if the you you know if the drug is coming out of the urban areas and going into small towns and rural um areas zin and you know so those places is predominantly white people see so what is happening there so you know what is happening there they're creating a market straight away there so zin for drug dealing that's why you 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 you, you have um, county drug line or whatever they want to call it. Why? Because people outside of probably London, in certain here they are they are using, they are using the drugs and you know whoever is selling them is selling them and you know they create a market for it, and you know we cannot play a blind eye to that so. You know that is even a part of um, the whole problem because you have people who are um, drug takers. You know people who take drugs, and then you have the people who sell them the drugs. Now, who are the people who are importing the drugs? 
that is another that is another thing because the black youths them 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 not have no money for import no drugs it have to be the people them in power zine with the power with the privilege who are doing such thing see but this one um black parents you know see this is what black parents need to know black parents need to know say yo once the item you know um once the item once the item um a push out I push out the black man or the black father out of the family structure. That is a problem, Dessa. Once the black family is pushing out the black father, see? Out of the family structure, replacing using your son see to replace or to become a man before time that is one of the problem also see that is one of the problem also because a lot of youths see a lot of youths become man of the house before time a lot of youths become man father fit fit for them brother and sisters before time before them even have youths themselves see and what 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 caused that what caused that because it's a combination of things still you know it's not just one um underlining things is a combination of things is causing that and we did a outline some of that earlier zin the system itself right but also we as 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 a people most most of us as parents zin most of us as parents we create a false impression we make the youth them have a, 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 a false impression and most of the time is 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 the mothers because them show out the fathers them out of the out of the household or out of the family for whatever reason it may be you understand so now the youth have this thinking that him 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 him, him have gone now take some risk now to provide for his mother and him and him and him, and him siblings there putting freedom at risk putting his life at risk see enough mothers because them are them you know the money are coming and everything look nice because the money nice them can buy this and them can buy that and then now say yo son oh you oh you can't buy this or you know where you do for do this what kind of job you do and you know what i mean None of them query there and some of the most yeah sometimes people query. But are we telling our youths them say yo don't get involved in these things because it's not that we don't want enough to have things or live a nice life. But the reality and the side effects of involving in these things is is a risk of your freedom. See? And it's a risk of your life. It's a risk of your freedom and your life. So choose a better way. And it is, you know, the, the, the parents, the parents of the stand up. Now, we know say, a lot of youths today, they now listen to parents. They now listen just to their mother. See? But when them have both father and mother there, you know them will pay more attention so that is a big part of the problem you know our family structuring you know see our family structuring because some of the youths them not listening to one parent enough youth them will listen to them father see because them have that probably that fear of probably 
them father than them mother. Zin. So, stop force out the fathers them out of the household so the fathers them can be there to balance things also to help the youths them to make better decisions in life. Zin. That is the reality. That is the reality right now because the system already designed and it forced the youths them in on the direction there. Zin. So them can get caught and go in on the prison system and then free labor and all sort of things. Not a slavery again. See? But we can see the disparity and the unf and the uh, and, and fairness within everything we are going. So my people, we just have to be wise. See and know what we are doing. You understand? And we must stop making the same mistake and repeating them. We must pull up the youth them and make the youth them know say, yo, this is another direction. We can go a other way of attaining and achieving in life. See? Yeah man, the mindset is progress, greatness. See? Yes I so have that mindset towards progress and greatness and you can attain and achieve anything when I want to see the youths them I go a prison and I go a jail because when the youths them start to involve in in um in making money certain way which is deemed illegal see the people um, enough people may can hear there's a jealousy within it because it's not just you see, the youths them are making money, you know. And at the same time, too, them have this gang feud um, between themselves and them shoot and kill themselves. And nobody now have no problem with them shooting and killing themselves, you know. Them have a problem with them making money and can go overseas and can do all sorts of things. Live a decent life. Or enjoy them life. People jealous of those type of things. But when they are killing themselves, nobody, no business. All them say, oh look at look 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 on them, look how they that is all they do. But whenever you start to make money and you don't have to depend upon the system, them is jealous of that. You understand? And even when enough of these youths them become um entertainers because most of them 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 into music and them rap and these things see that make it even worse because now you're you're streaming and you know you're making money from your streams and all of it is is just more jealousy how dare you do that you understand so we're not there for condone any wrongdoing see or any illegal way of getting funds Zin, but we just know that there is jealousy Zin, attached with everything we are going and them don't want the black youths them to uplift themselves any means necessary whichever way they do not want to see it Zin, and that is why the system is designed to keep down the black youths them and the black african family Zin? so be aware of yourself, know where we are my people. Let's reason in the comment section. Drop some solution. How we can change this. Zin, let's reason as a family. Zin, mindset, manners and respect. Give thanks and praise for life, health and strength. If it's the first time they are them a tune in on the platform, please subscribe, hit that notification bell. So whenever time we're here again, they are them can get um, updated and please browse the channel for more credible content. Blessed love.